Okay. All right, as you can see, first of all, it was sent in a very flimsy box. Look at this. It's crushed a little bit. It better not be damaged. This is a Copco. It's a beautiful aluminum pan. Uh, it should be about eight inches. I think, look at this box. I gotta take pictures of it if it's damaged. And what I wanna do, it's got a wood handle. I hope I can get the handle off because I wanna work on the pan without the handle on it. Pan. I sound like I'm from New York. Take the pan. Put the pan. Oh, please, please don't be damaged. Please. Please don't be damaged. There were two of these on eBay. One guy wanted a lot more than this. This was pretty cheap, shipped. Oh, it's pretty. Get this on the floor, will ya? All right. Ooh, look at that. I think I can polish this up really pretty. The question is, what well, does the handle come off? They fuse. The aluminum fuses to a steel rod, I think they use. The scratching is not too bad in this. Look how thick that is. It's not very heavy. Let's see. You think I can twist that? Use a toothbrush. Let's see if I can, uh, if this will turn. I'm not going to force it. A plastic toothbrush. Oh, yes! Yes! Oh! Oh, he got lucky. It wasn't fused. Oh. Oh. Oh, but maybe the wood won't come off. That would be funny. Alright, let's see. Oh! Oh, I'm happy. Ooh, look at that. I think someone said this was teak. I am, oh yes, yes. Okay, we are in business, baby. It's the little things in life. Now I can, I can work on this separate. I can wash the handle and, and polish this separate. All right, to be continued. So I hear this pan is from the late 60s, early 70s. Michael Lax was a designer, and he designed some pretty gorgeous cookware. Cupco. Not perfect, but a beautiful specimen, don't you think? So now it's time to make some eggs. Good morning. Today we're gonna make two eggs and see how this Michael Lacks Copco skillet does. And we're going to be using ghee. 